having a cupboard reorganization. This is actually a very big cupboard. <laughs> and if you're a small person, you can very easily fit under <laughs> So actually, it's really nice and big. Um, and we just need to put all of this stuff. We're going to put laundry in there from now on. We've moved it out of our big, big cupboards. A couple of really exciting deliveries this morning. So this includes some curl formers. And, oh, this is very exciting. Although it looks a bit like sweeties, they're not. They're actually curl formers so they can bend. I'm going to try these out. I'm really excited to get some heatless curls in. I might do a video on the on how I get on. I might do a video of how I get on. Let me know in the comments down below if you'd like that. I have just opened something very exciting, which is YouTube-wise. I have finally got back my cable. And by the time that you see this, I will obviously have been using it. This is a cable for my camera to connect into my laptop, which has sadly not been working for the last few weeks. And then, yay, I have a tripod, which is going to be so, so useful because I balance on loads and loads of crap. And then finally, this is actually for our working from home. I have bought two of these from Amazon. These are mini A4 size whiteboards, some pens and a duster or a wiper, <laughs> I don't know. And we've got a little stand so that we can have them in our home office. So I got Edward one too. Really, really exciting. Great little unboxing. Very, very practical. <laughs> So I'm really into Tilly's dog training. The maize bowls are really good for dog training and for stopping them eating so quickly. I have just ordered three of these Cam K9 mats. These are sort of like silicony style and they are from Absolute Dogs and it's their Cam K9 range or A OK9 and I love them on the whole and their sort of methods of training and these are sort of like an advanced snuffle mat so they help to ha keep your dog sort of busy with treats. I've also ordered a Cam K9 supplement for a Tilly dog. It's fast acting and it helps with their gut action and their brain action. So very curious to see how this works and I'm sure Tilly will love it. She's still doing it quite quickly. So the best thing to do is to allow 24 hours to allow the plant food to dilute into the water. So I'm really excited because I had a recommendation from one of my subscribers to look into amla oil 
So this has just arrived and I'm super excited. So this is organic almond oil. I picked just a small amount and it's for your hair. So obviously I'm trying to be very conscious about what I put on my hair and you know I'm trying to be a bit more thoughtful <laughs> with it and to make sure that I'm actually looking after it as much as possible. I have a major problem with my scalp following topical steroid withdrawals. I'm not sure if anyone else has experienced that. If so, um, let me know by giving this video a like and commenting down below. Um, this is really interesting. I've never heard of this before. It's a mixture of different oils, so castor, sesame, coconut, sunflower, and soybean and it's got a little bit of peppermint because apparently it doesn't smell very great. Um, it's not tested on animals as well which is a massive plus for me. I don't support anything that is tested on animals if it can be avoided. So this gives it a natural shine to the hair and it nourishes your scalp. So and apparently it's got amazing results. <laughs> so I'm super, super excited to try this one out.